please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, liberty, and justice for all. Please join me in observing a minute of silence. morning VBE tribe and happy Thursday. We hope that your day yesterday back on campus for the year 2022 was an amazing one and that you're ready to rock and roll for another awesome day at Vero Beach Elementary. Teachers and students and staff, you guys did a remarkable job yesterday as we were working through our new lunch uh, seating arrangement. Um, just some reminders, students, when you are outside in the courtyard, if that is your new lunch area, please make sure you treat that as the cafeteria. That means no trash on the ground, no running when you finish uh, your lunches. It's not the playground. Uh, make sure that you're cleaning up your picnic benches and making sure all of your garbage ends up in the trash can. We are also going to ask that all students head to their lunch tables first, whether that's inside the cafeteria or outside of the cafeteria. We will ask all students, um, once the lunch line is at an appropriate length, um, to line up. So just report to your tables first and we will dismiss students from their tables to the lunch line. Yesterday, when Ms. Van Bremer and I walked around campus, we saw some remarkable things already starting in the year 2022. So let's keep that momentum rolling for another awesome day at Vero Beach Elementary. Don't forget, as you are in your classrooms, in the cafeteria, in the courtyard, or all around campus, just please make sure that you're showing that VBE vibe of valuing respect, inspiring others, being responsible, and exercising safety. Have a great day, guys. Good morning, BBE, and welcome back from an excellent winter break off. I am so excited to announce our January reading competition, but before I do, I just wanna give a shout out to our top readers in our upper grade levels. Starting with second grade, way to go Xavier Rodriguez as our top reader, and Drake Lewis, you're in second place. In third grade, Gianna Smith is still the third grade top reader, and Owen Zuniga is now in second place. In fourth grade, we've had a lot of changes with Kaylin Coleman as our top fourth grade reader and Danica is now in second place and Michael Stanyard continues to lead the school he is a millionaire and so is Rosie Baco but what's exciting is we now have William Zhang in third place who is so close to being a millionaire we can't wait please keep reading as for our reading competition it is going to be against each grade level we are building a giant candy land board for the cafeteria and each week based on all the words your grade level reads you'll get to determine how many cards you draw to progress on the board you want to make sure that you're getting it done because each week we have a candy treat for our top readers and our top reading classes and at the end of the entire month of january the class the grade level class with the most words read if you've gone the furthest in our candyland board you will win a candy party so we look forward to you guys reading taking ar tests kindergarten and first grade you guys just gotta log all those books you read so that you guys can compete too we can't wait to see which grade level is going to win have a good one everybody
Sometimes I 